So enter Rogue's Den. See these traps here? Yes, they're traps. They're clearly traps. Turn, run on, and click the gate. And I didn't have run on, so that's smart of me. And keep running. And keep running. And of course, don't go in the middle there. Just go on these stairs here. Just keep walking across them. Don't hit any traps. You don't have to disarm anything. Now, there's locks on, there's traps on the side of these walls, so don't go near them. Just click that empty spot right there with no traps in it. And you should run right to the there. Then click here. No traps. Click here. No traps. And click here on the map here. And you just run by every trap in this hallway. And go here. Do some agility. It doesn't really matter if you lose agility because I think you'll be able to do it anyway. Most people won't run out completely. I still have 66 out of 66 thieving, which is good. Jump these. Can't. Nothing can go wrong there. Of course. Jump there. Walk across is very impossible to walk across plank. Not. Now this one's hard if you're doing it for the first time. If you look on the mini map, there's a wall there and a wall there. What you have to do is click right in front of you here, not the second wall. And then you can see how they're divided into sections. And then click the middle wall. Then click past the th last wall. And you, you can just keep running there. So you still haven't used any thieving. And jump over that. <sighs> this is where most people lose all their thieving. They see these uh, things and say, oh, I have to search every one of those. Or they lose time by clicking in between them and carefully and all that. With, but time's not really a problem. Now, all you have to do, go on the mini map and click right there. And big whoop, you just did it without having to disarm anything. Now, walk down here. Walk over here. Or run, I don't really care. Just watch out for that. Don't, don't just click here because you'll run into the spinning blades. The trick with walls and floor traps is usually if there's a floor trap with nothing after it, you can uh, run past it. But if there's three in a row, each one having something after it, you have to do them all, or do two and then run past the next one. Just like you're going to run past this one. Just click there. Jump over here. Don't think you can get away with doing over here because there's actually blades over there too but they're hidden now the correct one to choose is this one right here click on that it's a puzzle it's so complicated mm -hmm. and now watch carefully there's no penalty for opening these or getting them wrong you just keep doing that Watch this pattern. It's something like a zigzag. Zigzag's mentally challenged brother. And you go past here. about in the middle. Don't go in front of any walls yet. Now you see 
two walls, three walls here, but you only have to click two. First one, you click, second one, you click, and you run past the next one. And just do that. Search two floors. You can't get away with it by going in here, you'll just mess up and run past that floor. Because I tried to do that and it doesn't work. No matter how much you try, it's not going to happen. Again with the running thing. Run. There's a trap right here coming up, right there. So just run right over that, not on it, over it. And these, click in between each one. Keep doing that. Don't touch any walls here. Don't try to go around the side. All you have to do is do the same thing for the last traps on the floor. This one you'll walk over almost. So it looks like you're not going to make it, but you are. Along the sides, there's... Uh, traps too, so don't try to cheat. Alright, almost done. Make sure you have plenty of run here. Not like it's a big deal, but these are rogue guards. A lot of people find them really hard. All you have to do is make sure they're not near you by checking the mini map and get the flash powder which is on the ground and choose this guard if you can see him and as soon as you throw it run past him the flash powder will disappear after you um, get past this thing now I probably won't get anything here alright the moment of truth you can choose any one you want it's random I always choose this one but it doesn't really mean anything And that's what happens when you do get something. You get gloves and experience, of course. You get experience for most things. And I said you get gloves. I mean, you just get something. You don't specifically get gloves. I got gloves. Yeah. Um, so I can add to my collection. Where's this stupid banker? Alright. Now I have full rogues which is composed of gloves, boot, uh, boots, mask, top, and trousers. And if you put them all together, it looks like this. Um, and if you look at all the stats of it, it's not that good. Like, honestly, you don't really needed that.